Welcome to Virtual TVET. In this video, we're going to look at some of the simulations that are featured in our courseware. This is always one of my favorites. It's a manual transmission uh, simulation. Here we have this very nice diagram of these um, gears that are going through various stages of rotation here. And we are able to use the transmission, the gear lever, to shift the gear transmissions. And also, it will show here we're going into reverse, and it shows the power. The engine is moving through the transmission, through the gears to the, the rear axle. This is very important. Together with, we can see the gear ratios, uh, which is very interesting too as well. On fourth gear, it's always one to one. You can see that the power line is going straight through the drive shafts. On the other gears, you see it uh, going through different areas. This is a nice rotational view of the transmission as we look at it from all different sides. You know, the lab tech uh, objects are created in full 3D uh, renditions, and so we're often able, in many cases, to look at things from different sides. Here's another favorite of mine. This is electric motor simulation. Uh, almost all of our simulations contain uh, instructions of how the controls are, as they are different according to different types of technologies. We use different features uh, that we can do. Here we can look at different elements of layers of the stator core and the single phase windings and things like this. And we can and we can always there's some features that we can adjust. In this case, there's load and there's also frequency. So we can adjust these two slider bars to interactively look at how the motor changes in performance and the sine wave curves change as well. We can also see the diagram of the connections and we can see the unit spin around or we can just look at the front view from the side here. And that's also very informative. We can look at how the windings are behaving in the magnetic fields. So this layers different information on top of each other. This one is from our hybrid series, which is in one of our newer parts of the series, uh, which shows the hybrid transaxle simulation. And here we are able to uh, look at the narrative. We are able to have instructions also as well uh, on here. And then we're able to have the controls of the brake pedal and the start button, and also the to shift the unit and accelerator pedal which will control it. And so we can animate this. We can see then under different rotational speeds what happens between the motor and the generator and the engine too, where the engine is connected. But here we're focusing on the electrical part of the, of the hybrid unit. And we can see how this very interesting part of the hybrid vehicle works where everything comes together from the motor, the generator, and the, and the engine and how the power is shifted and transmitted to the wheels. This is from our HVAC series, which we are looking at a simulation for cooling tower and chiller units. And uh, the interesting thing about this one is it's a reverse cycle. So we can look at the, both the heating and the cooling modes. And so here we have like a, a system for a large house or a small commercial uh, application. And we're able to look at the different parts, such as the water pumps or the cooling tower or the, my favorite, this one is the four-way reversing valve. What happens happens here? This is the part that actually causes the, um, the reverse cycle to happen. And it's interesting to see the animation of this in detail. And then also when you zoom out too and to see how this works for the heating and the cooling. So this gives you an idea of some of the simulations that you'll encounter in the LabTech virtual TVET simulations and what you can expect to see in some of the detail that Thank you for watching this video. I hope that you enjoy your learning experience with LabTech Virtual TVET.